the headlines of Kent News. Thân lập Kemian of Vinh Thanh Suburban District received the advanced news title title. The launch of the fish release to recycle marine sources on the occasion of the traditional day of Vietnam fisheries industry. Vietnam now has seven seafood products exported to China, namely shrimp, crab, salmon, octopus, starfish, and cod. Hello and welcome to another edition of Continuous and Top News today. After the five-year efforts, in late 2022, Thanh Lộc Kemen of Thanh Suburban District has been recognized to get the advanced new style duro criteria. Coming to attend and present to the decision to the Kemen on May 24th morning was Vice Chairman of Kansas City People's Committee Nguyễn Ngọc Hè. Thanh Lộc Kemen of Thanh Suburban District was recognized as the new style duro Kemen in 2017. Since then, the suburban district has unceasingly invested and improved the quality of criteria. In 2017-2020 phase, the campaign raised over 180 billion Vietnam dong to build rural infrastructure such as bridges, roads, schools, health stations, counter houses. Most of the routes in the campaign have been concretized. The rate of locals making access to clean water stood at 90%. 7 out of 7 school sites got national standards. Its economic mechanism changed on the right track. Per capita income stood at 65.7 million victim dong, and the rate of poor households dropped down to 2.46%. Speaking at the event, Vice Chairman Nguyễn Ngọc Hè requested the government not to stop at what it has gained, but continue to pay attention to improving investing and mobilizing all sources to achieve the title of exemplary new style rural government in the type ahead. Vice Chairman of Kansas City People's Committee Nguyễn Ngọc Hè on May 23 came to attend the launch of the fish release to recycle marine sausage on the occasion of the traditional day of Vietnam fisheries industry, April 1st. The event took place on the fish raft of Nguyễn Văn Bong in Sơn Island, area number no. 1, Bồi Hữu Nghĩa Road, and was held by Bình Thủy Upper District People's Committee. In response to the Vietnam Fisheries Industries Traditional Day, leaders of Bình Thủy District called organizations, individuals, and people to join efforts to recycle aquatic sources by releasing fish and contributing to protecting, preserving aquatic organisms, especially rare and precious species, species of high economic values and export values, protecting the environmental landscape and aquatic ecosystem while defining the great role of the community in the protection of marine sources. Right after the ritual, leaders of Bantui Urban District and the majority of people led 500 kilograms of blue stock out to the river. On May 25th morning in Kerdo Suburban District, Kansas City Youth Union, in coordination with relevant units, organized the ceremony to respond to Earth Hour 2023 under the theme Saving Electricity is a Habit. Attending the ceremony was Vice Chairman of Kansas City People's Committee Nguyễn Thực Hiện. At the ceremony, leaders of Kansas City's electricity company called people to join hands to save energy, to protect the environment, and respond to a hour by switching off unnecessary electrical devices in one hour. Representatives of Kansas City's electricity company also presented the city 1,300 green trees, 30 trash bins, and 1,800 friendly environmental bags at a combined value of over 80 million Vietnam dong. On March 25th morning, youth union members of Tung Eng Ward, Nguyen Kiều Urban District, and collaborations in the ward jointly launched an environmental sanitation phase. In this phase, participants collected garbage, cleaned streets and in Kilgate Kangtel retaining dike area and collected trash on rivers, contributing to generating beautiful landscape in the views of visitors when coming to Kangtel City. Sassi is from Kangtel State Treasury said is up late on March 24th. The disbursement rate of public investment capital in Kansas City stood at more than 13% of the target set by the government and 15% set by the city's People's Council, with a total of 10 trillion 293 billion Vietnam dong of the local budget having been disbursed. In an attempt to speed up the disbursement progress of public investment capital, Leaders of Kangtel City People's Committee requested departments, sectors, and districts to consider the public investment capital disbursement as the important political task 
and as the foundation for implementing social economic tasks of the city. Leaders of the City People's Committee demanded relevant units pay active attention to transitional projects and assist in completing procedures of projects, in line with organizing joint supervision to boost the construction progress and speed up the adjustment of investment levels and compensation and resettlement progress. An exhibition called Imprints of 70 Year Vietnamese Revolutionary Cinema is taking place at Ho Chi Minh City University of Culture and lasts until April 6, 2023. The exhibition showcases more than 200 photos, documents, and artifacts about events, people, and outstanding works, briefing on the development of the Vietnamese Cinema Center over the past seven decades. The exhibition expects to attract and bring the public, especially students of the University of Culture, useful information and a historical corner of views on the history and culture of the nation in general and the history of the Vietnam Revolutionary Cinema in particular. According to the Agriculture and Rural Development Ministry, Vietnam now has seven seafood products exported to China, namely shrimp, crab, salmon, octopus, starfish, and cod. Seafood product export registration is totally performed on the China Import Food Enterprise Registration System of the General Agency of Customs of China. As of now, 805 Vietnamese enterprises have been granted seafood export licenses by China to boost the export of fresh aquatic products to the Chinese market. Export units are required to get certification in food staff safety, veterinary hygiene, and codes by local agro-marine products management offices. Among all pleasures, maybe breeding and rearing on the mental birds are every culture, takes the most care, and every culturist breed birds for various purposes, finding, singing, or simply watching. Breeding parrots is relatively popular now because parrots are easy to breed and they are smart. In Ninkyo Urban District, parrot lovers have established a club called Gentle Parrot Lovers. In the early evening every weekend, Club members not only gather to hear birds singing, but also provide each other with bird caring and training skills. Yip Dai Thanh, living in Ninh Kiều District, is attached to a pair of parrots as his relatives. He and the parrots are inseparable, and each of his others is responded immediately by the parrots in a lovable manner. This bird breed has already been trained for a long time, so I feel easy to rear them. After hard or sad working days, seeing children playing with the parrots or seeing the parrots flying high in the sky makes me very amused and helps me relive all nuisances in life. The parrots not only entertain visitors from Ninh Kiều, but from Bến Tre province also. It takes a lot of effort to tame a bird into a lovable pet. Parrot breeders look after the birds, from food to habits, like their children and relatives. Besides, birds are also at risk of flying away and never returning when they are released. At this time, a joint effort is needed by all club members to search for the birds which shows solidarity, one of the criteria set by Cantor Parrot Lovers Club. Breeding a parrot since it was a baby bird, caring for it is our own baby, and seeing it grow up, we will feel unhappy whenever it is ill. Playing with parrots helps us relax after a hard working day. They are well behaved. This bird breed can talk. They can say hello, mom, dad. Also, they can whistle and perform various acts. Their habits take shape over time. We have raised them since they were babies, so they feel close to us even when they are not fed now. We take these occasions to teach them to obey us, not just to fly to and back. Over time, every culture will not stop as a simple folk artistic beauty, but gradually raised to new heights and new living concepts. Love does not just exist among human beings. At a certain close-knit type, 
Kev and their owners still become close to each other like relatives of a single family. The updated weather forecast also wrapped up this edition of Cantin News. If you want to watch again in this bulletin, please visit our website, cantertv.vn. And now thanks for being with us. Goodbye and see you next time.